Muli Children's Family has 11 different campuses. We have over 7,800 children that are being taken care of in our campuses. These are vulnerable children, child mothers, together with their children, street children, abused, neglected, former child prostitutes, and all the children who are vulnerable and need a place to call their home. Over the last 34 years, Muli Children's Family has been able to witness the transformation and successful reintegration of over 30,000 young people now who have become women and men who are transforming the world in different professions, different parts of this country of Kenya and the greater global community. When I was a child, I experienced extreme poverty and I had to feed for myself. I thought that if I ever had the means, I would help others in need. When I first witnessed the devastating effects of hunger in this community and other communities, I knew I had to take action and make a difference in their lives. The demand for higher education and vocational training is only increasing day by day. Many projects to improve our capabilities to minister to the women and the children and our care include Malindi Women's Center. This center is a beacon of hope for women who were abused. It houses 63 women and their children and provides spiritual nourishment. The project described here are counseling and vocational training girls and the boys dorms with the growing needs in the community. We found ourselves in need of new facilities to provide a place for more and more children. These new dorms will ensure that every child has a safe place to play, learn and sleep. Sports center that is nearing completion once complete, the MCF Sports Center will be a state of the heart indoor sports facility that will be home to the Muli International Sports Academy where MCF children can train in karate, uh, football, that is American soccer and uh, gymnastics. Pottery Operation on Sustainability. Our pottery operation is up and they're running. Muli Mission Obstor. The Lord has put on my heart the vision to build a state of the heart mission Obstor. Workers are currently finishing the first stage of maternity ward and a trauma unit, which are the greatest needs in this community. Every year, we are so privileged to host medical camps in our MCF Ndalani campus, where we have volunteers, physicians, nurses, medics, and they come as teams. They work together. They attend to patients from all over MCF Ndalani. And the last medical camp, that was done by MCF Canada team. We had about 40 team members who came along. And out of that, they were able to attend to more than 3,000 people who came from as far as 100 kilometers, 150 kilometers away, just to access free medical care. Not only do we give them free medical care, we preach the word of God to them and we provide lunch for them when they are getting treatment. So we are so grateful for the teams that come from all over Canada and the USA just to give their services to these dear people, these dear ones. 
We believe that education is an equalizer and therefore MCF takes great pride in ensuring that all the youths and the children are given the best education ever. At Muli College, there's been an establishment of a computer lab to enable all the students access real-time information and be able to do their practicals and understand how to do projects through their computers. At the primary or the kindergarten level, we have the ECD, the upcoming complex in MCF Ndalani, a complex that, e that will house over 300 young children and they will be able to access everything, every care in that complex, the ECD Ndalani complex. As part of our mission, we offer various spiritual programs designed to nurture the spiritual growth of our beneficiaries and co-workers, all geared towards creating a relationship with our Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you for partnering with us. Thank you for being our friends. We love you.